It's a numberful Wednesday. Join me as we learn how to count, solve, and enjoy math. This is Teacher Tin and welcome to our class. For today's session, we're going to count numbers from 1 to 100. Are you ready? Come on, let's begin our numberful journey. Today, we're going to count numbers from 1 to 100. As we count all the way to 100, we will answer these three questions. First, how do we count numbers from 1 to 100? Second, what do we need to remember when counting numbers from 1 to 100? And third, why do we need to learn how to count? I know you're all excited, so let's now jump into our lesson. Counting also means observing and seeing the things around us. Now let me ask you, how many eyes do you have? Right, you have two eyes. Hmm, how many ears do I have? Great, I have two ears. How many fingers do you have? Can you count? Very good! Ten fingers! Can you see the image beside me? Where can you see this? Correct! You can see this on the cell phone. Now, what are those symbols that you see on the keypad? Yes! Those symbols are what we call numbers. Numbers are the basic unit of mathematics. Numbers are used for counting, measuring, and comparing amounts. Numbers are written in symbols 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and nine. These symbols are also called numerals. Are you ready to count? Let's start counting from one to ten. Join me as I count the objects on each set. Take a look at this. One bird, two elephants, three jars, four ducks, five giraffes, Six bells, seven bugs, eight dogs, nine cows, ten flowers. Good job! Now let's continue counting from 11 to 20. Are you ready kids? Let's go! 11 hearts, 12 balls, 13 stars, 14 cars, 15 apples, 16 fishes, 17 candies, 18 moons, 19 smileys, 20 ducks. Way to go! Do you know that these numbers can also be written in words? Repeat after me as we read each number. 1, 2, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 17, 18, 19, 20. Were you able to get all that? Hmm, let's see. I will show you some items and you have to try to count the items given. Are you ready? Let's go. How many candles are there? Yes. There are 14 candles. 
How many ice cream cones are there? Good job! There are 16 ice cream cones. Yummy! <laughs> now, how many fishes are there? Correct! There are 12 fishes. How many bowling pins are there? Great! There are 11 bowling pins. Let's have another one. How many dice are there? Very good! There are 19 dice. Awesome! You're doing great! But wait kids, there's more. We haven't reached 100 yet. Take a look at this. To continue counting numbers from 20 to 99, you can join the sets of 10, like 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, and 90 to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9. Excited to reach 100? I am too! We can practice counting numbers using a hundreds chart. Let's practice counting 1 to 100 through this activity. This hundreds chart is missing some numbers. Can you supply the missing numbers? First, we need to fill in this box. Hmm, what number comes after 29 and comes before 31? Right, the correct answer is 30. Now let's try this one. Correct, 42 comes after 41 and before 43. How about this? 54. Good job! Do you know the next missing number? Yes, 59 should go here. What number should go in this box? Right, 64. Let's find the next one. Hmm, do you know the answer? Correct. 67. We have more missing numbers. What number goes here? 92. Next. You're right. 94 goes here. Last one. Hmm. Good job. 98. You did great, kids. Let's all clap our hands. Now, Let's go back to the three questions earlier. We can count numbers from 1 to 100 using symbols. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9. To continue counting numbers from 1 to 100, you can join the sets of 10, like 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9. Numbers are used for counting, measuring, and comparing amounts. Counting with numbers helps us understand the quantity or how many objects there are. Great job, kids! I hope you enjoyed and learned a lot about counting numbers today. If you did, Click thumbs up and share this video to help young learners like you to count, solve, and enjoy math. Don't forget to click the subscribe button. Again, this is Teacher Tin. Thank you for joining me today and see you on our next 
Number Full Wednesday.